Good morning and welcome back to another build on Jurassic World Evolution 2. Uh, I got asked by Just Finley to make a Stegoceratops enclosure. So that's what I'm going to do is like show you how to make a very simple and easy enclosure. And it's going to be for the Stegoceratops. And this one I'm not going to be using any decorations other than anything that's in the train tab. So that's going to be the rocks, the plants and also the food plants and uh, dirt, things like this and uh, I'm just going to show you how to make one that's nice and simple. I can see I've made it so it's slightly curvy, I'm adding all the path in now trying to get it somewhat neatish to the fence line um, and then at this point here I, I really do love adding these to the enclosures, it adds that little bit of realism, these little back off areas where you can then lock the creatures in. In reality if you're dealing with something of a high category, in other words it's a dangerous animal to be in an enclosure with, you would have them fenced off in a different area whilst you did maintenance, cleaning, putting out food or an enrichment for creatures within the enclosures. Obviously you can't do that in Jurassic World Evolution but it's just that I put in there because it gives that little bit of realism to me. So as you see in the background now I've raised the ground in the middle. I'm adding a few rocks and making it like fit the environment which is tropical. Adding tropical rocks. I'm adding the food source that they eat to the centre. And then what I'm going to do, just dot it around, because these are inquis inquisitive animals. Uh, they're probably going to watch the guests walk around. So I'm doing these little dirt paths, so it looks like it's been trodden on. The grass has been like stamped down. These are large creatures, after all. So it just shows like the natural path that they've made through the shrubbery. They might not even use it, but it does add to that certain look that that gets walking on a fair bit. And this is the main path they make around their enclosure. And yeah, that's it. A very nice and simple, easy enclosure for these Stegoceratops. I got a few shots of them within the enclosure. And uh, to me, this is very aesthetically pleasing. It's a very easy enclosure to make. I've not gone out of the way and put tons of decorations down. And it's, it's just nice simple took me a spare to probably 10 minutes to make so if you don't have much time it's a really quick enclosure to make and yeah i hope you've enjoyed this and it's given you a little bit of inspiration on how to build your enclosures especially if you want to do a quick easy nice and simple looking one and in the comments below let me know is there anything you'd like to see me make a particular enclosure in particular habitat or just enclosure for a certain types of species and yeah again thanks for watching until next time i'll see you later